The Voodoo Boys are an enigmatic gang from the Pacifica district in Night City. They have a dark reputation for their incredible net running skills and mystical voodoo flavor. It is believed that all voodoo boys have pure Haitian blood on their veins. They are exclusive, secretive and distrustful of outsiders. On the deep dive demo of 2019, we had a glimpse of how hard it is to gain their trust. They are so exclusive that their estimate member count is somewhere between 50 and 250. The gang was originally founded by voodoo priests from a prominent caste of the Creole culture of the Haitian diaspora. In 2062, Mother Nature took a heavy toll worldwide. Annihilating forces of climate change wiped many islands off the globe and Haiti was not spared. The gang then became the zealots and guardians of the Haitian refugee nation in Night City. Almost all Voodoo Boys are net runners, therefore cooling suits and state-of-the-art neuro interfaces are common elements of each member outfit. They can be easily recognizable for their black clothes and African aesthetics element like dreadlocks, necklace and earrings. Their base of operation is on the Coast View subdistrict of Pacifica and it's called the Chapel. The notable members of the gang are the TI Neptune, Philip, Agif, Austri, Placid and Brigitte. Brigitte, the leader, and Placid, the second in command, were the focus of the deep dive gameplay of 2019. Their philosophy and structure is based in uncovering the secrets of the old net. They secretly probe the black wall in hope of making contact with rogue intelligence systems that live beyond the barrier. If you have no idea what that all means, I will do a video explaining the old net and everything related in the near future. But for now, in a nutshell, the black wall is a virtual wall that is said to keep free AIs from breaking through into the rest of the virtual world, possibly causing the end of the world along with Skynet, anyone? To ensure this never happens, Netwatch works to keep others from destroying it. However, the Voodoo Boys believe the free AIs will help them conquer the virtual world and does look for ways to destroy the black wall. We know that this will be a part of the plot somehow in Cyberpunk 2077, but I wonder how big that part will play. We know that this story of the game is not about saving the world though, so maybe this will not be very explored. The main source of income for the Voodoo Boys involve hacking of data banks and accounts and probably selling them for the biggest bidder. They also hire themselves out as mercenary net runners for private contractors who are interested in hit and run net running operations. In the next episode, we will have a deeper look into the unstable gang of the Maelstroms. To make sure you don't miss that, go subscribe to the channel right now and activate the notification bell as well. I hope you do it so I can see you next time.